I'm Cindy. And I'm Anitra. And, and together, together we are, are I, I Spy Queens. Queens. Hello, 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 everyone. Happy New Year. Yay! Yay! Hopefully, God will bless us all and keep us together and make this a better year. Because we all could des we all deserve to have some peace this year, right? Am I right? Okay, without further ado, we're going to get everything going. We're going to let Cindy go first as usual. But we're going to move everything back so there's no distractions in the video for you guys. There we go. Got to keep our shoe there. <laughs> um, we and Cindy both is going to do some of this jar. This was a Christmas gift, again, for my father-in-law. And I think we got some of the other pieces that we put to the side mm -hmm. um, so we can see if we can pair some stuff up. Thank you, partner. We're going to get these scissors going, and let's get into it, as Cindy say, her favorite word. Look at me. Well, yeah. <laughs> Come on, now. There we go. I'll let y'all see that I'm cutting it open. Hope everybody is safe and having an enjoyable day. Yes. Evening. Nice. Because it is a Friday. Well, at least here it's Friday. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. At least it's Friday here. It's about, what the time is it? About 10 o'clock? Yeah. 10 p.m. here. And the lovely, as they say, uh, honeymoon capital of the world, Niagara Falls. <laughs> All right, we're going to move some of this over, and I'm going to let Cindy go first. So, here's Cindy. Hello, everyone. Oh, well, here's my jewelry. I have a slave bracelet on today. I finally got her to get one, you guys. Yes. And, of course, my normal rings. So, let's get into this lovely pile of goodies, goodies, goodies. First, we have a... Looks like a... Maybe a nose ring? A belly button ring? Something. Some kind of a ring. But it looks like body jewelry. Don't look like a regular ring. Mm -hmm. I wonder. I don't see any marks on it. But let's see. Anyway. Nope. It's not. It's a magnetic. But it's pretty. I like the way this got like a shine. Almost like rhinestone-y shine. Right there. So that's a fave for me. And we have a ring. Mm, it's probably about a ten, nine, because it fits that finger. About a nine. Oh, we got the sizer. Oh. Let's see how right I, accurate I am. Ha <laughs> ha! It's a nine. <laughs> Did you say it was a nine? Yep, I said about a nine, nine and a half, because it fit my pointer finger. Oh. So it's got a blue stone on there, and then it's got pink stones down here, and, oh, it's got hearts in it. Cool. Oh, I might have to take that one. It's got Is hearts that one in magnetic? It. I don't know. We'll have to see. No? <laughs> we'll have to test that one and see. So that's a fave for me. And let's see what else we have over here. And put these aside because they're earrings and I don't see any matches just yet. Mm. Of course we got tangles over here. Okay, we have a silver tone bracelet. Mm. I don't 
don't see any marks on it, so let's see. Oh, it's not picking up. Oh, the end piece is. Got a little pull. This piece here. There's always those end pieces. I know. Maybe it was replaced. But we'll have to check that. Oh, and the wing. Hmm. wonder if that uh, palm tree that we found yesterday goes with this. This is another palm tree. Oh, wow. A cute enamel looking one. Yeah, it's like a mint green with a A. Is that an AB crystal in the middle? Is it sparkly? Yeah. And the gold enamel down here. I don't know if you guys can see that sparkle. Let's see. In the middle. <laughs> As nature says, shiny. It's got a nice extender on it and don't see any marks hey you guys I have good news though I go to the eye doctors this week yay <laughs> so hopefully they can tell me something of what's going on with my eyes it's not no pull for the actual chain or the extender, but the the thing again, the closure piece, oh. the spring clasp is magnetic, but maybe we'll, we'll have to check that. And next we have some pearls, three strand pearls. Pearls are always pretty. Yeah, I like pearls, whether they're real or fake. So those are adorable. And it's got a very, it's got an extender here. So, with the spring clasp. Those are pretty. And we have a bunch of tangles, you guys. Mm -hmm. Nietzsche's setting me up for failure. No, I don't like tangles. We have a bicycle. Oh, this part actually moves. That's kind of cool. <laughs> Let's see. Nah, it don't move. But that's still kind of cool. The wheel moves and the little brake thing. It's a clock. It's a little clock. Oh, I thought it was moving for a second. Oh, I think maybe it might be broken. Maybe. It's still cool. We have a charm bracelet here. It's got red and blue crystals like stars and circles and there's a star there there's a heart here it says something but I'm not sure oh it says I love you oh I love you mom and it's got a <coughs> I don't remember what this symbol is for what that symbol is for. Maybe breast cancer? Yeah, I think so. Okay. And it's got a tag over here. Thought it, it says something. One moment, please. It's spelled A M O R E. Amori? Yeah, that's what it's like. Amori? Yeah. Maybe I'm not. There we go. I don't know if you guys can see that, but. Mm. Does it say the same thing on the other side? Yeah. Okay. So, that's pretty. That's a big one, though. Yeah. 
I slipped it right on my wrist without opening Maybe put it. put on your ankle. I know. Maybe. That's pretty. That's another fave for me. Oh, I forgot to check to see if it was magnetic. And it's not. Well, the little charm, one charm is in that heart. But the rest of it's not. Hmm. Maybe we'll test it. We got another one of these little rope bracelets. Wish we had, like, do they make those things? You know them things, like the ring thing tells you what size mm -hmm. the rings are? They make them things for bracelets and necklaces. Tell you what size they are? Yeah, like you could just slip it around yeah, it. Got, it's like a round cup thing. Yeah, they do have those. Yeah, so that we could tell without having to measure it. But that's a dang, uh, small one. Is a big one. Oh, no, this one is magnetic. It's got pull to it. Mm. I don't think there's no match to that right now. And we got these shell necklaces, which I don't like. Shh, you didn't hear that from me. <laughs> so like they be in everybody's job. I know. We have like uh -huh, dozens. Yes. Somebody like them. Every time I see them, I, I think know. about the beach. I would wear them to the beach only. Let's do a mag thing. Oh, this is long. This is really long, you guys. I'm going to triple it. It's like plastic -y, rubbery type. Piece. It wouldn't be us if we didn't drop something. I don't know what that was. I don't know was it an earring, which I'm betting it was an earring. Okay. It's like a brownish coffee bean type color. That's what it reminds me of. Especially these beads right here kind of remind me of flattened coffee beans. <laughs> this is a big, big boy. This another silver ring yeah. with what looks to be kind of like rhinestones. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. And it don't have no pull, so maybe. No, that's the marks from the. Oh, it does say something inside. Okay, small right there. Come on, light. Light the loop, the loop, the loop. It's a sterling. It's words. It's sterling. That's written in there. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it's written, sterling is written in there, so we'll have to test that. Definitely have to test that. And this is a size 13. Ooh. That's a big one. So we'll have to test that. And we have a little dainty one. It's a butterfly. Yeah, that's a kid's ring. Because it don't even fit on my pinky. But it's also an adjustable. So, Because right now it's only a size 3. <laughs> that's tiny. That'd be like for my grand our granddaughter's mm -hmm. fingers. Yeah. And here's a cross. What a nice long chain. Uh -uh. Hmm. I'm attached. Did you get? Oh, it's magnetic. That's why it's stuck to my ring. Mm-hmm. That's easier for you to put it on. Yeah. Those kind. So, that's pretty. <coughs> I don't see any marks on it, though. Let's see. Cross is not magnetic. 
The extender and, and the magnet is definitely magnetic. <laughs> and the chain isn't, so maybe, possibly. Mm. Oh, we got another one of those magnetic thingamabob. Ah! Look at That was an earring. Yeah, I'll get it. So. Yeah, we'll do these last because they single their range. Yeah. So, um, you could have it as a double bracelet or open it up as a necklace. But it's magnetic, the whole thing. Yeah, we'll do that stuff last. This this is nice and that's it. So, it looks like the back of a watch. Maybe we still can find it. And go with some of the pieces we found yesterday. Maybe. Mm -hmm. And it's not magnetic, so worst comes worst if it's sterling silver and we can't find the watch to it. We got a piece of silver. <laughs> Mm. Got something in the baggie. Mm. Oh, is that a oh, gotta put that in. There we go. Oh, that's cute. It's like the tree of life. Mm hmm like the tree of life thing. Let's see if we can get it together here and put it on the... It's got one of these dog tag thing latches. I don't know if I can get that loose though. Can you get that loose? No, no, just leave it. So, but it's a pretty long chain with the pendant. So, I like that. Oh, I didn't look to see if it was. Yep. The chain definitely is. But the pendant is not, so maybe we'll test the pendant, not the chain. And this looks like a, used to be a belt buckle. It'll go in crafts, probably. Because this could be popped out and used as something else. Go tone in black leather. Letter L with the mother of pearl kinda behind it. So that'll go in craft. That's and it. So that's w the end of my portion. Hope you guys are enjoying the video so far. And here's Nidra. <laughs> hello, hello, hello everyone. Here's my jewelry for today. Another piece from Beauty Fly Bargain. Uh, Brandy is her name. Go check her channel out. Okay, let's get back to the jewelry. We, yeah. We got the rest of this jar. We got a couple miscellaneous earrings that I told Cindy not to go through because we're going to try to pair them up together. So we're going to put that in here. Okay, let's get this stuff out of here and get going. Ooh, I hate when beads fall, mm. but my kitties probably love it. They can get in this stuff. Here's another piece uh, to watch. I don't know if you guys remember from yesterday, like the rose gold color. I'm going to stick that in there. Here's another, like miscellaneous something that maybe went I saw something that this might have went to yesterday yeah there was um some kind uh, of picture thingy. yeah so we'll stick that to the side and more of those little watch ringlet things like a pink um opal color and then uh like a Enameled blue. We'll throw that in that pile. And we have a um, 
rows looks like. Um, one of those stick pins or hat pins. I've never seen one like that. Then we have a gold tone and green. It's like a peridot. Like peridot. Yeah, peridot. Pass me the ringlet thingy. The ringlet thing. The yeah. <laughs> necklace holder. Oh, this is going to have to be doubled. It's pretty, though. Like see-through crystals. This is pretty. And it's in very good condition, too, as well. So, I don't think it has a maker's mark or a opening. But, nevertheless, it's pretty. That's one of my favorites. Um, we have a thick, chunky, two-layer necklace. No, three layers. Um, it looks like a silver see-through kind of color. Uh, big old lobster claw class. No maker's mark. Sorry. <coughs> um, then we have a safety pan. I think it says share points. Big old pen, gold tone. Then we have a coin like bell jingle necklace. I want to say when I see these kind of stuff, I think of the gypsy wear. Um, but these look like they got um, Roman type of uh, what is it called? The people that wore the leaves around their heads and all white oh, back in the eighteenth something. Yeah. What is it called? Mm. Roman Greeks or something yeah. like that. I'm sorry yeah. if I got it. Yeah, if I got it wrong, you guys. But gold tone. It's got a dangle right there. No maker's mark, but it's cute. Um, then we have a, a bracelet, tennis bracelet, um, like the tor topaz color and the white diamond color. And I don't think we have a maker's mark, but it's pretty. I'm going to say it looks like it could be an Avon piece not magnetic so I'll check it out but I'm betting it might be an Avon piece but it's pretty nevertheless it what's that stuff over there stuff I'm still on oh uh, um, we have some look like mother of pearl type of uh things I don't know what this made it came out of I don't they don't have like a bracelet maybe. they don't have any holes in it no unless then they got split yeah it do I got the hole right there so that I go in the crafts. Um, we have a bracelet that looked like somebody maybe done engraved. Kind of looked like someone wrote it. Like scratched it in there. I think it says Francis. I'm not sure, you guys. I think so. I'm not sure. Yeah. And it's... They go, oh, this is a different kind of class. I don't... Not a lobster claw, it's a... I don't even know how to open this one. Mm. How do you open this one? This, I've seen them before. I'm not going to fool with it too much. It oh, there we go. You got to open. I w if you guys know the name of this kind of clasp, let me know. <laughs> I'm fighting like dear life trying to get it open. And then it clicked back. Like handcuffs. Gold tone. That's magnetic. <clears throat> then we have a 
handmade bracelet, I think, with uh, black and white and yellow beads. I think it said Wild Thing or Wild Thoughts. Yeah, Wild Thoughts, I think it says. What I heard. That is going to kids' lot. Then we have, I want to say this is a native piece. Cute little guy. Orange, white, and black, and blue. That's the name that was on it. It was asking for 75 cents for. Oh, it's got a, like a button clip. Come on. I don't know. I don't know if I want to mess with it. Look tight, but this is pretty. Pretty, pretty, pretty. That's a favorite for me. Then we have a enameled white and black with uh, stones, and one of them is missing right there. Necklace. I'll put it on the mandrel. That's how it lays. Then we got a long leaves. <laughs> blue, dark blue, like an auburn brown color and green tassel. That. It's like a antique gold color to me. That's what it looks like. Then we have ooh a double layer, which probably is definitely not gonna fit on here. But these are um, pretty, almost like China color type of a beads, like a red. Blue, mother of pearl. That's pretty. Let me see. It's long, you guys, too. I want to say. Yeah, I think these are glass beads. These look like clothes and me. Yeah, a little bit. Yeah, mm -hmm. big old lobster car class. This thing is long. Come on. It's almost like a 15 feeter, you guys. Inches, I meant to say. <laughs> 15 inches. But this is pretty. It's on a blue rope. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Then we have a black and white chain necklace. With, uh, let me see how many layers. One, two, three, four, five, six. Six layers, I think. Let me see. One. Yeah, one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, six layers. Necklace. Then we have a gray tone bracelet with um, rhinestones. I don't know if that's anything missing or is it pushed in right there with a bit, uh, not barrel class, but what kind of class is toggle this? Class. Yeah, toggle class. Thank you. No uh, maker's mark or nothing, but it's pretty. We have another necklace here, a little dainty one round. Silver tone circles. I don't see no opening to it. Let me see. Like, that's weird. Like, how do you put it on? Uh, uh, no. Yeah. Look how little that is. <laughs> that is really little. It's got writing on it, too. One second, you guys. One moment, please. 
Uh, say 925. What? What's the magnet thing? It say CI925. Right there. That's weird. Yeah, the I mean, the, is it the ringlet thing? Yeah. No, it's the clasp. Oh, okay. I mean, it's it's magnetic. Maybe it's silver plated. I mean, because it didn't pick up all the way. Because normally, you know, when something's super fake, it it picks up in the air. So maybe it's plated. I'll test it, see if it's plated. If it is, it'll light up blue for a little bit and then it'll fade. So we'll know it's plated. Uh, we have some glass. glass beads. Um, like a cat eye, tiger eye color right there. Emerald green, white, like a moon glow type of brown color. Sea beads in between. It's long. Sorry about that, guys. You can double it, too. Colors again. Like a purple pretty color or a royal blue color. Then we have a double layer sea bead. Got a lot of layers. Yeah, I want to say it's over six for sure. You guys, when you run across necklaces like this, you got to be careful. It'd be always earrings attached inside because I just found I one hanging over there. But this is like a, a goldish color brown and pretty color, like a party color, like a disco ball type of color. Then we have a gold tone necklace, dainty one. Looks in good condition, other than it look like a little bit of wear or scruff right there. Then we have a silver tone bracelet. Thick one, too. It's not magnetic. But that's got a little pull. Let's check it out and see. And it says, this on the tassel right here, it says 905. Has anybody ever ran across something that say 905? And the camera showed it really good. And it says Italy on it also. Right there. It's kind of worn a little bit but i never ran across nothing that say 905 so i'll test that and let you guys know also and now we have a little dang glitter color Looks like it's got some kind of stuff in it like it moves pendant um a little silver tone Necklace, what does it say? Robin or oh, Rebecca? Yeah, Rebecca. So, any Rebecca's in the house, let us know. And maybe you can have this free. It's magnetic, though, like the extender and the. Yeah, it's magnetic, but it looks like it's in good condition. Nevertheless, nevertheless. Look at that chain. That's pretty. Then we have a pair of uh, shell earrings. Gold, silver tone. I like these. I have a um, necklace that's similar like this that got both metal in them. Mm -hmm. So we got that. Have another dainty little neck uh, necklace, silver tone with a And we have another ring, an uh, emerald green. This is pretty. Emerald green with a uh, crystal line. 
It is a nine. Size nine. It would match my nails. Pretty, pretty, pretty. Green, emerald green is like one of my favorite colors too. It's not magnetic, you guys. I'll put that to the side. Uh, we have a watch that look like it had its better days. Like it's a Timex. I think it is. That'll go on the craft. We have a kitty. You almost look like a Hello, Hello kitty. kitty. Is it? Mm -hmm. Pretty pendant. What do it say on the back? I'd be hitting that. Look like it's, um, I don't know what it say. Either the way the writing is on it. Another piece to a watch. Crafts that are gone. Another palm tree, double palm tree, gold tone. Um, a butterfly. Some other, these are like mis mis miscellaneous. Oh, this is T R A um, P pendant. Um, something that go to a tie pin or a mm -hmm. shoulder pin. Okay, we're gonna get into these earrings and then another uh butterfly uh pendant. And then we have a silver tone bracelet that that is magnetic but it's look like it got it says yeah it's do. it says i g a g i a g i on the thing which i never seen that before either come on focus now um, right here somewhere it says AGI. And um, on the other part it says, yeah, no, it says AGI right there. Right there. AGI. So anybody know what that means, let us know. Sorry if you guys hear the fire alarm thingy. I did not change it yet. <laughs> I keep forgetting. Yeah, it says AGI. And... It say 925 on the little thingy right here. But we all know that don't mean nothing. So, all right, let's get into these earring business. And um, here's the watch pieces, which we did not find the watch because that other one was not the thing that went with that. So, these are pretty cool. This goes to that other. Did we? We don't know what you did with it. These, these. Well, we got a match to these, you guys. Yeah. The fans. The fans. Um, watch pieces. Watch pieces. An earring that is. I don't think it's got a match. I don't think it's got the match to those either. Watch, watch, watch. Single earrings, yeah, these are, that was probably the only match inside of there. Oh, I thought I saw this one. We have a piece of a, um, probably a cute bracelet it was at one point. Um, yeah, I see some yeah, cats. Um... Rainbows. Oh, that's it, you guys. There's no, no other matches to these. So these will all go into the craft lots. Now this, you guys, is a thing for your for your wine glass. Grab me that wine glass over there, that empty one. To notify where you know what glass you have. This is my glass, you guys. But yeah, they go on there like this. So when you're out at a party, you'll know what champagne or wine glass Can is I call yours. It a belly button. <laughs> no, no, they they uh they rings for the the side where what your drink is. Okay. All right, you guys, we're gonna pick out our favorites, and we're gonna end this. We did not know it was gonna go into it this long, but uh, here we go. All right. This was a fave. 
We didn't have a lot of favorites. Yeah, there's other favorites. Yeah, uh -huh, I liked that. Where's the piece oh. at the pen? Oh, right here. Yeah, we had it in the... Let's go to the... This was a fave. Here's another one of those things that go around your drink. That one. I called it a belly no, button. No, I think it's... Either it's a thing that go around your drink or those fake things you put in your nose. One of the two. Yeah, that's what I thought it was. All right, you guys. These was our favorites. Please let us know what yours was. Again, Happy New Year to you, you guys. We appreciate our subscribers that we have and continue to pray that we uh, progress more. But until then, have a good year, a good evening, a good day, and stay safe. God bless. I Spice Queens, out. Bye-bye.